Hi, this is Brian Decker. Congratulations on getting your home under contract. I want to take just a few minutes today and go over with you on what you can expect to see over the next 15, 20, and 30 days of this escrow process. Now that we got your property under contract, what we're going to be doing is now focusing on building and updating your application so that we can have an accurate file to go ahead and push over to the processing department. So what you're going to be seeing over the next couple days is, is you're going to be receiving an updated email from me going over all of your rate and pricing options for you once we get these title and escrow documents in from the seller's selected title and escrow company. Once we've received all those title and escrow documents, we're going to be ordering the appraisal, which the appraiser is going to be going ahead and contacting the listing agent. Once they get an inspection set up, it's typically about four to five days before we get that report back sometimes a little bit quicker and sometimes a little bit longer just depending on the appraiser's current workflow. Once we go ahead and have all those title and escrow items in, we're going to be sending you an initial loan disclosure package. This package is going to be electronically signed and it's a rough draft. Please note it is a rough draft. Many times we have to put place or holders in certain places to make sure we can go ahead and disclose this loan on time. Now through the processing and underwriting process, all of these items will be updated and will be correct when you finally sign your final loan documents with the notary. So do not be alarmed if you see the number of dependents is inaccurate or for an example, the exact dollar amount that you have in your bank account is not the exact number. Many times we use generalities because we have to get these disclosures out to you within three days of opening of escrow. Then we're going to be going ahead and my processor is going to be reaching out to you and once you've signed your disclosure, sending you a checklist of any items that we need from you in order to get your file through underwriting. Please do your best to get those items back to them no later than 24 hours. We want to move this process along quickly and we can only fund your loan as fast as you allow us possible. Once you get those items back to us, the processor will then go ahead, take all the items you've received and given to them, receive your appraisal that we've gotten back at this time and submit it to the underwriter. The underwriter basically is going to be checking off all the boxes of all the required items that we need from you and once they've reviewed that file, they're going to be issuing our official underwriting approval. At this time is when you'll remove your loan contingencies with your underwriter. We will call you and congratulate you on this process and we'll let you know any little minor items that we need to be able to get this file into closing. Once we've gathered these few items, any kind of third party documents we're waiting on from IRS transcripts to insurance, any of these items, we'll gather those final items in send it back to the underwriter one additional time and they will go ahead and they're going to clear the file for closing, meaning all of the conditions that we need to draw up loan documents on this file have now been completed. We'll send you a copy of your closing disclosure for you at this time outlining the exact amount due at closing. That typically comes about five days before your closing escrow. Once we go ahead and you sign your closing disclosure, we'll be sending your loan document package to the escrow company. They'll go ahead and make an arrangements with the notary to sign all of your documents, both from the escrow company, the title company, and the mortgage company for you. You'll get all those documents signed. The seller will sign their documents. You'll wire any additional funds needed to close to the escrow company. Once all of that happens, we'll be funding the following business day and then the home is yours. So that's just a basic overview. If you can even remember just 50% of this, you'll be ahead of 99% of homeowners out there. So take care and we look forward to working with you.